So this project started when we wanted to create something that put together both art and activism. And um, the idea was that in a, using art, we were able to break barriers when it came to connecting with people and putting a message out there um, about immigration because it's so controversial and lots of different, um, there are lots of things that may trigger people and uh, cause them to stop caring about the issue or to stop even learning about the issue. So the idea was that we would put together um, some kind of art project where people were able to connect with each other through the art and through creating something beautiful that doesn't um, push anyone away. I haven't been like able to paint for almost two months. I was in the hospital. I mean, I like the, the idea of having a big mural too and what it represents. That's why I'm here today. The image itself is representative of a lot of different things. Um, for example, we have the different skin colors, which are pretty obvious. Um, they represent diversity and the types of immigrants that we have in the United States and in California. And then, um, but you notice that the colors aren't necessarily blended together, they're separated by lines, but nevertheless, um, they still work together in unison, and that's what immigration is about. We don't have to all mix together, we don't have to all somehow become a singular thing. We all keep our differences, and that's what makes the whole idea of immigration so beautiful. All of my classes are engaged in service learning at Sonoma State. I'm an English teacher with um, freshmen. And um, so I'm partner with the Center for Community Engagement. And they send out a newsletter. And I saw Rima's call um, for anyone who might want to participate. And it um, just fit so seamlessly with my students' writing and also connected to lots of um, the issues that my students are facing. So we want to spread that project onward and so basically the idea is that these butterflies around us are going to take flight and they're going to go off to different parts of Sonoma County and even perhaps beyond that and each butterfly is going to represent a specific immigrant or a family story and that's all going to be documented on our website. Luckily we were able to get so many volunteers come and help us and that's kind of what, it added meaning to the whole mural itself because we were able to bring together a community and from all different age groups, we had people from five years old to over 80 years old, so that was really cool. But they all came and they all painted and they all gave their best shot and um, it makes the mural mean so much more.